This is an apology to my quilt making friends. I know you're all wondering what's going on. Many of you have been staunch supporters in my quilt making ventures. Uh, I've made four or five quilts online and uh, they've always been real experiences. <laughs> and I've been quilting like mad now since I got back from India, but I just don't seem able to put them on video. It's a different process and um, it's totally mind-blowing and it's been a real venture for me. I'm just starting my eighth piece. Um, I can show you some of the finished pieces. This is my most recent piece. I'm finally starting to get the spirit of these CD quilts, I think. This is the one I did right before that one. Uh, this one is made up all of uh, Indian uh, sari pieces, sari trims and, and that I picked got from a tailor that saved them for me. So, and the one before this was this one. I think you've seen it. You start on the edge and you work towards the center. This means you don't know what it's going to look like because you don't know the center yet. It's going to evolve. So for me, it's been a mind-blowing process because I'm used to planning, you know. I did them all on the walls, remember? I'd, I'd have the whole thing on the wall before I ever sewed a stitch. Um, now, uh, it, it, it's like it, it's making itself somehow. And the state of mind that you're in as you're doing it, it requires a lot of letting go. I'm, this is some of the stuff I'm going to use. One major breakthrough I just made is I just decided I don't have to make them look like CD quilts. A lot of people, when I talked about my dilemma on land here, on line here, <laughs> no, I'm on land, you're on line. Um, People said, well, why don't you just make, follow, make your style. I'm going to use this piece somehow. I had this piece. I'm going through stuff that I never could use in the normal quilts and trying to uh, make inroads in, in my stash of stuff that I thought didn't really fit in the way I made quilts before. Now there's a place for it. Or, there's this giant one. Well, it's crib, crib size. Uh, and that's also mainly pieces that I got in India. Scraps from tailors that I brought back. This is an interesting piece here with all the sequins on it. This is the one I brought back. It has something mine don't have. <laughs>